the Queen is not getting enough help from mother royals, a royal author has claimed. The 95-year-old monarch, who has COVID, has faced a turbulent start to her historic platinum jubilee year. Royal author Clive Irving claimed the Queen was not getting any help from the people who should be helping her. Mr. Irving, who has released an updated version of his book The Last Queen, insisted heir to the throne Prince Charles should step up. The royal expert told Express.co.uk, if you look at the situation in terms of the monarchy being like a corporation or a brand or company, they're not handling the situation as the CEO of a corporation would. This is the moment Charles should really step forward and say I'm going to help my mother in dealing with all of this. It may only be seven weeks into 2022 but the monarch has already faced a number of royal crises from the furore over Prince Andrew's lawsuit to the Prince of Wales potentially facing police questioning over an alleged cash for honours scandal. Meanwhile, Prince Harry is in a legal battle with the Home Office over police protection for his family while in the UK. Mr Irving said, it's the combination of all these things happening at this very special time. It needs to be shut down in a way that nobody's shutting it down. The Duke of York settled out of court last week in his sexual assault civil case in the US. Virginia Dufresne accused Andrew of having sex with her after she was trafficked by his friend Jeffrey Epstein. The royal has always strenuously denied the allegations. The Queen stripped her second son of his honorary military titles and royal patronages last month in a bid to distance him from the royal family, and he will no longer use his HRH style. But there are calls for him to lose his dukedom connecting him to the city of York, which is a decision that ultimately lies with the head of state. Meanwhile, Charles potentially facing police questioning over an alleged cash for honours scandal linked to his prince's foundation. The Prince of Wales and his former most trusted aide, Michael Fawcett, were formally reported to police last September when allegations first surfaced. Mr Fawcett, who has since resigned as Chief Executive of Foundation, has been accused of promising to help a Saudi billionaire donor receive British citizenship and a knighthood. And further royal family difficulties look set for the rest of the year. The Duke of Sussex, who is living in California with Meghan Markle after quitting royal duties, is publishing his tell-all memoir in late 2022. Commentators will be questioning whether the Platinum Jubilee celebrations will save 2022 for the royals or whether it will become another Annas Horribilis for the monarch, who lost her beloved husband Prince Philip last year.